I am so excited for these. We all know everybody likes to stay connected at Christmas time. So I came up with this project, very rushed project, to ensure that happens. I'm really excited for it. Can't wait to open this up. Because we all know the best way to spread Christmas cheer is singing loud for all to hear. Let's get building and then I'll tell you what these are and how they work. Let's go. finished. And if you haven't figured it out already, these are ESP8266 Christmas ornaments. They can connect to the internet to spread Christmas cheer for all to hear. My room is now a mess so let me just clean up and I'll explain how these work. Alright, that's much better. Okay, so each one of these Christmas ornaments has an ESP8266 Wi-Fi microcontroller built into it. And what these do is they can send information to the internet or receive information from the internet or just over your local Wi-Fi network. Now I've made a bunch of different designs. This one's my favorite. And I also made what's called a FANT server with SparkFun server. Basically it's used for putting sensor data online or yeah basically only sensor data so if you have a temperature sensor it can upload the temperature of your room say every five minutes and it will stay and stay logged but I'm using it in a different way I'm using it to measure Christmas cheer every time you run one of these it connects to the Wi-Fi network and it checks the fan server for how much Christmas cheer there is if there's more Christmas cheer than was previously checked, then it will sing a song. In order for there to be more Christmas cheer, someone has to take one of these, whether it's in their house, this house, anywhere in the world, as long as it's connected to the internet, and send more Christmas cheer. Simple as that. And now, that we've sent more Christmas cheer. This one is going to check to see if there's more Christmas cheer and it's going to play a song. So every time there's more Christmas cheer, everybody's ornament is going to sing a song. Now like all of my projects, this one's open source. There's going to be a link to the GitHub in the description and you can build your own. It does require surface mount components, again, I know I'm sorry, but it's actually fairly easy to populate these. Anyone with a little bit of soldering skill could figure it out. I have a whole bunch of these so I'm probably going to give some to my family and friends and keep an eye out because as usual I like giving stuff away so I'll be giving away some circuit boards and maybe some populated ones and I was thinking of selling them in the Tindy store. They won't be available for this Christmas. Late video, late project, it happens. But maybe next year and then we can see how much Christmas cheer everyone can generate. If we have thousands of these things all over the world, it's just going to keep adding up on the SparkFun website which is really cool and I'm excited to see how fast it actually grows. You can also reprogram these just like an Arduino. There's an easy connector here and all that will be documented on how to do that but 
It just requires a FTDI chip, like any Arduino, and uh, really simple to program. So you can use it as a microcontroller, and you can do your own internet-connected IoT Christmas ornament things. Anyways, everyone, thanks for subscribing. Thanks for liking this video. It's been great. Merry Christmas. Happy New Year.